sounds good. That's on your part. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs>don't forget two mavericks at the same time the giveaway is still live you've only got a week left to get over to see on the big end.com buy some merch all this sick stuff we got you some warm weather gear and get that chance to win this brand new ford maverick trimmer this brand new trailer mass s3 just a beautiful machine get it done it's important it is important what else is important you know what else is important <laughs> we got ourselves storm boys Big snow came out there. Big snow, dude. <laughs> that being said, we got to get the sleds out, dude, and we got to try them. I'm pretty much uh, ready to womp everybody's uh, toots, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to ride. Let's go. Yeah, let's check it out.
<laughs> she uh she hooks it and then also when she doesn't want to hook she slides pretty good so <laughs> it, it looks it good is, out there though it sounds it good it's been forever since i've been out here like there's so many things i've just forgotten and how like there's some bumps over here and this like i always just imagine flat and it's like it's just been so long but it's so much fun it's good energy out here yeah, yeah it's great i mean this is fun coming through here and trying to drift this and i can tell joey's like right behind me i'm like trying to keep it close and so the first couple i did two or four wheel then i switched to two wheel to really see if i could really pull it around hard so there's some evidence of the two wheel slide over here <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> i just uh with being the 64 now i kind of wanted to like get a feel for it so I'm like ah we'll throw in the old two wheel shoot some stuff backwards Joey, what do you think of this sucker? I don't know what bumps Mike's talking about because I didn't feel any bumps personally. This thing's so smooth. Yeah, it's hard to like really judge the machine out here. We're in a snowy field, but like for what it is, this thing's a blast out here. Like I, at any point, however fast I'm going, I can just pitch it and it'll just start sliding. Like there's no body roll. There's no feeling of, oh, I think I'm going to flip over, which I have a 64 inch X3. So that's kind of like my reality jumping in this is completely different so real used to flipping over <laughs> i have not flipped over yet but i'm used to the feeling of like okay maybe this is a bad idea but yeah i mean it'll be interesting to get out on some real trails and kind of you know judge it better that way but out here and uh you know just taking some corners really fast on flat ground it's it's a blast it's really good out there hey man sorry hey, about thanks, your man. Grill, uh, grill i don't know <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the GoPro footage is going to be pretty funny. <laughs> do, you, uh, do you imagine that this thing might be capable of doing like cyclones or something of that nature? You know, it's it's funny you say that. I think we should find out. I would like to see that. All right, all right. So two step, two stepping out there. Okay. Wow, oh, let's go. Okay. Right for it. Yeah. Come on, baby. Oh, it wanted to. Yeah, it wanted to. It wanted to. Huh. Look at that. Look at that grass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, small jump. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good effort. Heck, wow. heck of an effort. There. Is it just on three wheels the whole time? Because that's what it feels like. Man, it, like that, that inside left is just like bouncing. It's just bouncing. It's light. It's not pulling it off the ground, but yeah. it looks a little sketchy. Yeah, I stopped. <laughs> I put it in the trail active, and that was way better the second time. But still hard to keep it in like one exact spot we need a little bit more snow yep. to get some really good ones but for uh for just dirt it's pretty impressive let me just uh tell you real quick you can fully lock the front diff okay this is this is new information <laughs> this is new information i guess we'll go back out just one one more try maybe yeah, it's worth yeah. it for science It doesn't look impossible yeah. to roll over. Yeah. <laughs> that was slightly better. That was slightly better. That was pretty rowdy. Yeah. It looks like you, you could potentially roll it over. Yeah, like, I was getting ready to just like rip it full right in case <laughs> I had to. Like I was completely ready to, cr oh, I got a check engine light now, so that's cool. Didn't like um, that. Mm -mm. Did, no, did not like that. But yeah, I was ready. If I felt it come up, I was ready to crank it the other way and try and correct that but yeah this is a good time hey you done good yeah look good done good Ixus, you ready to shake these sleds down or Dude, what i've been ready since i don't know what date i bought mine but i've been ready since that day i need to see this t cat do <laughs> some t cat and man I can hear them pipes sing, dude, you know, you gotta get in the pipe. That's what they've been telling me for years. I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Edge XC 800, Matt's Steed. You gonna give us a little yeah. show or what? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'll be the first one to test uh, because basically I just can't wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, I gotta get out and rip this field, so. We need to see it. Mike says he gotta put a little heat in the motor. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll put some heat in her. All right, all right. Yeah, yeah. Look at the sparkles in that paint. Or maybe there's are chips. Gosh darn, <laughs> that's slick. <laughs> Old no track himself right there. <laughs> oh, look at that sucker hook. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of controversy throughout that track. Yeah, it turns out. Look at these two red boys, dude. You think we're gonna see our first drag race here? I don't know, they're li they're looking at each other. Hey, hey our mine's faster. <laughs> Miceless red, Miceless red. <laughs> Was that, was that Matt? Matt? I couldn't dude, tell. They're Matt's both reds. Hook it. He's got good studs in that thing. Son of a witch's tail, dude. Smoked Son of my gosh. Woo. Oh, rolling. Wow, dude. I missed that pretty well, but I think Matt came across for sure. I think so. Got a little ripper on your hands, huh, boy? I'm taking on that balloon. <laughs> 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 man! <laughs> oh man! Look at old graphics kid himself, dude, out there doing the wheelies, dude. There's not much attraction yet, but I think it's gonna come. Not yet. It's still early in the season, dude. We gotta wait for another storm, another two inches. Yeah, that's what we need. <laughs> Joseph, my man. Here's the thing. Bud. My sled just doesn't move. It just doesn't move. Which... Did you fill the planter up with dirt? Yeah, hey, listen, it was kind of to be expected, but uh, yeah, she, she doesn't really go anywhere. Yeah, you'll, you'll make your way, you'll yeah. make your way. I tell you, man, what, what do you think, Mike? I saw some stuff. Honestly, I'm super happy that mine's running. Honestly, Matt's is real quick out of the hole. <laughs> Once we got out, it did feel like it settled a lot, but his is very quick coming out. But, uh, that run going get on fire. What? They're running around fire. I can't hear you. He said, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> Oh, oh, yep. Makes sense. <laughs> Dang. Heart of cat Doug. Never thought I'd oh, see the day. <laughs> Dang, that thing runs good. I got long track Steve. Thing rips pretty good. Yeah. Oh no! What? He was smoking too hard. Yep. Oh. Oh. That was a lot of smoke, Steve. A lot of smoke. Uh huh. Yeah, and the belt broke, and then I hit the throttle one more time, and it just went boom. Oh. I was like, oh crap. Yikes. <laughs> but it must been the belt winding up. See if, come on, baby. She's still got life. She's good. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Man. A little wobbly. I don't know. Did it I, seem bent? Something seems bent. Oh. There may let's be see. more to the story. Let's just here, get a little though. reaction from Steve. Is that fair? Are you good with that, Steve? Yeah, go for it. Just... That's a bent huh. crank, probably. That's the back sheave has definitely got a solid eighth inch of run out. Yeah. So we'll think positively here and hope that maybe it's a clutch problem, yeah. but <laughs> possibly a bent crank shaft. Yo, it oh. wouldn't hurt my feelings to actually get to ride my Apex this <laughs> winter. <laughs> wow. Maybe that's why it just I mean that's probably why it instantly smoked the belt. That probably didn't just happen. Maybe it did, yeah. but maybe that's why the 2006 was $1,500 <laughs> in hindsight. <laughs> Adds up. Yikes. Two cat. Okay. 
So far, it sounds good. Okay, okay. Uh, got some <laughs> legs. It sounds solid. It sounds solid. Wow. Too fast. I can't even keep up with the camera. There is something extremely comical about Seuss riding a snowmobile. <laughs> Especially that one. Especially a 94 Thundercat <laughs> 900. Yeah! <laughs> oh. Wow. I don't know, boy. <laughs> hey! I don't know about you guys. <laughs> Fucking pretty fast. <laughs> it looks pretty fast. It looks pretty fast. It doesn't, man. It's it, such an interesting sled. It doesn't really like. Doesn't really scream. You're just going really fast. You should hear it from down here. She makes some noise. Does it? Yeah. I mean, big 900 triple. You know, it's like a diesel basically. Yeah. It's <laughs> motoring through there. Yeah, it gets up there in a hurry. It's definitely no traction whatsoever. We need another storm, dude. I was wrong about this storm. There. <laughs> There's no snow out here. <laughs> well, there's no snow out here. So, oh, that suspension, uh, I saw you get a little air back there off that bump. I mean, my experience with sleds is there is no suspension. So this one, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's, it's honestly pretty good. I was, ding -dong. I was really, really thinking I was going to call out Matt to a drag race and then after driving mine and seeing his. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Probably still do it though. So. Yeah. I'll tell you what, I'll get things fired up. I want a piece of this Thundercat. Done! <laughs> Done! <laughs> that sounds like somebody just threw a bunch of trash in the cover and just rolling around. Well, that's his problem. He's got rocks in his track, bud. <laughs> that sucker ain't right. <laughs> hey, that's not a backup sled. <laughs> sure uh -huh. is. What the I, heck? I found a new competition sled. Yeah, if I know. knew this was the backup sled, I would have thrown mine into the ditch. Dude. <laughs> Got a little roll race going. Nick Seuss, what happened out there? I think my brain is locked up. This is gone. You guys are done, man. I don't know, man. You might be in trouble, man. I have no I, traction, Mike. Right? You got studs. I feel pretty good about that because I was only going half throttle, so. Yeah, it makes like, sense. Full throttle. It makes sense. Spinning like I am. Spinning like freaking it's cats and dogs out here, dude. My brake is cooked. I really should have stopped running it. Why don't you get that a grip? Oh boy. Yeah. Oh, not good. We got brake problems. Oh, my again. Green, dude. Let me tell you about brake problems. 2022 all over again. Brake problems cause a lot more problems than just brakes. There were some things I saw out there that didn't expect. That sled is quick. <laughs> Should I run it on the premium mode next time or? Ooh, tough one. Oh, because you, you had it on the race gas mode that time? <laughs> <laughs> wow. What are you doing? Just testing out my new sled. Right, 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 right. <laughs> this thing's got like a pretty long break in. It's like 600 miles, so we might as well start getting some of those, you know, out, out of the way. way. Yeah, break my machine in properly, please. Ex excuse me? <laughs> I don't know if it's stranger watching Seuss drive a brand new player snowmobile or a 94 Thundercat. <laughs> That's both things you wouldn't really expect to see. No. Yep, really uh, taking her easy. <laughs> and you can smell that oil. She's really dumping it to it. That might be the slides. That could be too. <laughs> Probably right on the edge of the track, melting to the <laughs> slides. At this point. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't think he knows about that. Oh, I, there you go. Okay. Get him to park in the snow here. Release me! <laughs> <laughs> 
Wait for it. <laughs> Our sleds are trash. <laughs> <laughs> they are still trash. Holy moly. That's a beautiful sled. Turns out. A lot has changed. Yeah. Looks good. Sounds that good. That is a freaking aw that is so smooth it's incredible how smooth that is and these are the roughest conditions we're just on frozen rough ground you feel nothing so imagine just, when you're on yeah. good stuff i just came off riding a creeper to freaking <laughs> that is like you're you're just and they go hey. imagine going forward in time 30 years yeah uh, it's a good point maybe more than 30 years i'm real excited to win that what's that that's what oh. <laughs> I made me more excited that we decided today's event wasn't for points. Yeah. It's working out. Yeah. It's working out good. Sorry, Matt. Dang it. <laughs> Anybody else gonna take this thing for just a little? Someone's gotta try it. It is wonderful. Okay, okay. I didn't break it, I didn't roll it, it's perfect for the next guy. Nice slit though, right? This is awesome. Talk to the rules committee, unfortunately, since you already have a brand new player sled, you're ineligible, but thanks for- Tough break, bud. Can we get a skidoo? <laughs> no. Dude, it's awesome. Yeah. Who's next? sled compared to my giant pile of crap <laughs> unfortunately i talked to the rules committee and since you already have a polaris as well you're also in eligible dang it Tough break, win, Mike. But... sorry about that all right, all right it is so soft like i that is like doug said worst conditions and it's so plush and smooth phew somebody's next somebody else got to ride it Wow. It's so quiet when it lands. Like, I know. It really is. It just it really looks like a pillow. Seat. Like yeah. you just jump onto a pillow. So what exactly is the plan here? <laughs> well, we were hoping to blast through the little pond here and it would look cool, but the ice has actually gotten pretty thick already. So Mike's decided that he's gonna slowly drive his snowmobile on it to break the ice up so then we can water skip. I don't know if Mike's thought through the second part <laughs> of his plan, but I'll watch it happen. I agreed with it. <laughs> yeah, let's see it. Mike do what he's doing. Oh my no! Oh. <laughs> huh. The ice was the ice was a wave. I don't know if he's gonna get away with that again. <laughs> wow, okay. I gotta go get mine. Yeah, we're good. Now. Never doubted him for a second. We're good now. <laughs> Wow. Now we're talking. <laughs> Good for him. That yeah. was cool. One more, boy. Is super fun. I disagree with you. Personally. <laughs> Man, I don't think so. it's so simple and so easy. <laughs> That's how your bar 
Yeah. 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 <laughs> She's barking. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of fun. That's just good fun. Just good fun. Just a nice. Turns out water's pretty cool too. <laughs> I'll see if mine will go. Yeah. It's got to. Yeah, it doesn't Dude. got to. It could sink. <laughs> Mike to do something good good something he talked he was talking about doing more wheelies and I'm like I'll see if I can do a good wheelie in the water and sink I mean, you did so. a pretty good wheelie dude but you're lighting a fire underneath these boys <laughs> Justin. probably learned what we needed to learn here some of the sleds okay other sleds not okay based on the fact that I didn't clearly win the drag race I also think I want to implement a uh, mod budget everybody needs to spend money on these sleds Mike is uh he's out of control you can't stop this guy it's the way he's been his whole life once he starts he'll be here all day He's got to be on the bottom of the pond. There's no way to just do that. He's got to be on the bottom. I don't care what's happening. It's, oh, cool. it's awesome. Oh, yeah. Just a pro. Oh, yeah. You don't think yours will do that? Ooh, read, dude. Wow. Just great work right, out listen, there. Listen, an idea came to my mind. Okay. Which I think everyone's going to love, except for one person. Okay. okay. I don't like this already. <laughs> Nick Seuss, you need to take my sled and do a water oh, ride. Hey, I no, love dude, this. I, I love this. I Come on, dude. It, I don't even know how to ride sleds. I can't do it. It's like, <laughs> dude, it's like riding a bike. You just, just let the throttle. I never learned how to ride a bike. It's like <laughs> riding a scooter. I don't even know how to spell scooter. It's like sitting on a couch and not putting any effort into it. I don't it. own couches. <laughs> I'm just saying. Try it. Rolling slow. Gun it. No. Just pull it up. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're done, dude. No. Nah. Uh, you know the part of the day where it starts to feel like maybe you should like chill out before more gets broken? Yeah. I'm starting to get that feeling yeah. mm -hmm. from I concur. today. I concur. For a shakedown to... day, I think we probably got what we need. I think you guys shook your stuff pretty well. <laughs> Trying to get Seuss to water skips so probably the limit for the day. Yeah, that's for another day, dude. My little finger hurts. Too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, load them up. Yeah. Let's do it. Doug, where are we going? Okay. So yeah, no cheap sled challenge would be complete without a visit to our favorite place to get cheap sled parts. So we're on our way to Mickey's Sleds and More, the land of all the snowmobiles and all the parts. And uh, based on our little shakedown, like 
we saw a couple things that need some attention, right? Joey, you need a track super bad. Some would say. Uh, Mike, <laughs> or uh, Steve needs a clutch super bad. Uh, so we gotta get a few parts. So to try to make this fair, here's what we're doing. We changed the rules a little bit. Everybody's getting $250 to spend on their sled for repairs or mods. If they have to go beyond that during the competition, then they're gonna lose points. If you don't need to spend that money, you choose to save it at the end of the competition, you're gonna be able to exchange that money back in to add points to your total. So a lot of strategy going on here. Could see some wacky things happen. The bottom line, we're going to Mickey's. We're gonna get some parts for these suckers. Let's do it. We have arrived. Uh, what do you got here? Uh, Junk? This is a useless clutch. It turns out it's actually perfectly fine, but it's the wrong clutch for my snowmobile. So it's just all floppy on the crank. No good. So you're hoping to trade that in, get the correct cl clutch, and maybe not cost yourself too many points. Hopefully, either for a new clutch or a nice belt. I would take a belt for this. Oh, thing, smart, you know? smart. Okay, okay. Joey, what's your strategy here? Uh, try to find a track so that my snowmobile actually moves when you hit the throttle. That would really be beneficial in this challenge. So we're going to see what we can get into here. Probably a good idea. Yep. All right, Mike, what are you trying to get for your cheap sled here? A few things we're looking at. really want to make my sled more comfortable more than I'm worried about performance. So I might try to find a set of like handlebar spaces or risers. And then found out water skipping the other day that unfortunately the front shocks just bottom out instantly. So maybe okay. talk about a rebuild. We'll see. Interesting. Because we have some events coming up that I'm going to need this thing to just perform. So you're blowing your whole budget on comfort. Uh, Interesting maybe, strategy. Maybe. All right. It might pay off in the long run. All right. All right. Are you worried about these guys upgrading their sleds or are you just uh, laughing at this no, point? No, no, I'm good. I think I'm going to look around here and see if I can't find a couple studs. Oh, and then don't. maybe some handlebars. My handlebars are pretty bent and it was kind of uncomfortable riding it. They moved a little bit. So see if I can't find some good handlebars. And then other than that, I don't know. It may be a pipe if it's there. If not, I'll just keep the money. Okay, uh, okay. It, it ripped pretty good. All right, all right. Good luck to you. <laughs> don't worry about this. <laughs> I don't want it. This is not important. <laughs> what is that, Joseph? Oh, it's a track in pretty rough shape, missing quite a few logs, you know. Looks like it's in excellent shape to me, probably at least $800. That's, that is uh, a beautiful a track. That is a great looking track. I mean, you know, look, at, you can, look at how many different studs you can put in there. You can go insides, outsides. Pre-drilled, that costs a lot studs. more. Hi, <laughs> right, Mike, what are you doing over here? I'm just, you know, trying to find some hopefully good parts over here, and I think I might locate them looking for Oh so. my gosh, you're after that handlebar riser? <laughs> yeah, so I think you can get away with the two, maybe three inch on this, so I'm taking a chance. But at least look at this way, if I can buy the taller one, and I got too long, I'll just cut it down. Yeah, yeah. I so. mean, that's a good find. I think those things are worth at least $400. I'll talk to Mickey though, see if we can get it for like 300. It'd be sweet. It'd nice be upgrade. Sweet. What do you think of the strategy here? All these guys are blowing their money. Just blowing their money. I'm in, uh, I'm in Justin's ear just trying to freaking get him to buy whatever he can. You know what I mean? Mike yeah. Reed's here, dude. Just anything that's shiny. Ah, give me two of those. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't spending a dollar. Nick Seuss ain't you know spending a dollar. Mike Reed's buying oh, handlebar yeah. risers. You might as well buy that too, dude. Get, you need that. <laughs> this is for your indie from last year, dude. <laughs> All right, pretty good haul here. I think a couple of these guys did decent. Maybe there were some errors made in judgment, but you know we won't know that for a while. So Mike, <laughs> what's what? What did you do? Listen, I got a handlebar riser so I can be a little more comfy on the sled. I got a new primary spring because the one I had was shot, and I got some spark plugs. Twenty-eight bucks. Pretty reasonable. Not too bad a point set. <laughs> Pretty reasonable. <laughs> Joe, Joey got the biggest item by far. He got a track, so he actually has lugs now. Yeah, um, not super stoked about the condition of it. The the lugs are fine. The inside is more what I'm concerned about. But uh, Ooh. you know, that's for another day. I kind of <laughs> I didn't have many other options here, so uh, we're just gonna see how this works and 
Hopefully it doesn't bite me in the butt. Steve, how'd you do? Yeah, I'm also gambling on some cheap trash. I found a used belt, <laughs> which is not normally what you buy. Oh, well, that's <laughs> yours? <laughs> a used belt. <laughs> uh, I think that was 25 and then mm. they are putting a new stem in my clutch to try to keep costs down. So I'm not 100% sure what the total will be. Hopefully it's not much. But then I should be ready to rip. All right, and so it begins. Right. I'm holding on to my money for a while. Matt, you're doing the same. Seuss is doing the same. There's nothing here for me. To... I think these guys are <laughs> too early, maybe too early. But uh, yeah, gonna be fun. So thank you guys for being with us as always. Uh, you probably noticed that it's taken a little, little bit longer to get this video out. So going forward, we're making some changes that we're super excited about. We're gonna put more effort into each video. We're gonna get more stuff in there to bring you guys better things so a few less videos but we're going to bring you bangers that's the plan so thanks for your patience thanks for being with us as always and doing everything you do that supports the channel buying that merchandise don't forget that stuff big giveaway right now or if you're buying those parts or donating on patreon or buying through that rocky mountain link just all of it thank you guys so much don't forget to follow us on all the other social media platforms as well ig tiktok facebook we got it all so see you guys back here couple days some real fun stuff